Welcome back to a new episode about random number generators in PHP. Even if you think that you will never need a random number, I will tell you that you will. And there will be lots of reasons why you will need it later on. So PHP has a function for which is pretty easy to use. And right now I want to focus on that specific function, which is called rand. We can either supply no parameters or two parameters. So let's see what will happen if we generate a random number with no parameter. So let's say that we want to echo out rent and refresh the browser. And you can see that the output is a pretty long number. And if we keep refreshing the browser, the number will change. Well, there's a reason why the number is so long. Because it will generate a number between 0 and the maximum number. And there even is a function where you can see the maximum number. So let me comment out my first echo. And let's create a new one. Let's echo out a function which is called get rand max. So it gets the random number's maximum value. Save it. Refresh the browser and you can see the output. And if I refresh the browser, you can see that the number doesn't change. I will understand why you don't need any number that is this big. So let's remove the get rent number and let's start focusing on the function rent and let's and let's generate a random number in between two specific values. So inside our parentheses, let's add parameters. You can either add them as integers or variables. So let's start with the integers. So you need to specify a minimum and a maximum. So let's say that the minimum is 1, comma, and the maximum is 10. Let's save it, refresh the browser, and you can see that the output is a smaller number. And let's refresh it a couple times, and you can see that the number is in between 1 and 10. And what we can do is replace min and max with two variables. So let's create min, which is equal to 1, and max, which is equal to 10. And let's remove the parameters, so min, comma, max, save it, refresh it, and the output is exactly the same. This was it for this episode. If you do enjoy my content and you want to see more, leave this video a thumbs up, and if you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button.